Hello everyone, my name is Kayab and welcome back to another game review. So today the long-awaited Battlefield 1 was released on most consoles. Obviously not PS3 and Xbox 360. And I have been waiting for this game for quite a substantial amount of time. And the wait was definitely worth it. Might I say that. The opening title itself was very similar to Saving Private Ryan because the graphics are absolutely phenomenal and just the whole gist of the game and the whole premise of the game is just absolutely mind blowing and it's it, it's just so hard to explain without truly experiencing playing this game of how beautiful and how, how well made this game actually is. One of the main things that I do like about this game is that if you die, you will actually be respawned as a different player. You don't sort of go back to the beginning of the level, uh, you don't go back to a checkpoint, you just continue on, sort of like in a different section, but you continue on as a different soldier. And this was sort of a real eye-opener for me, because it shows the just it sh shows the expendability of these soldiers in World War One, and it's really quite sad and very depressing to know that if one of these died, like one of these soldiers died, didn't didn't really matter back then. It's yeah, it's it's pretty sad. One of the very common things about Battlefield is that you can pretty much destroy, drive over, blow up, whatever you want. That's in view and in your terrain such as houses and fences and this has been prominent in Battlefield 1 which I am incredibly happy about because who doesn't like destroying literally everything so another section in Battlefield 1 is set in the Arabian Desert where you play as a rogue Brit sort of like an almost rogue British agent who is paired with the rebels of the country who are trying to take back the country and bring peace back to their homeland and what this section does is gives you the ability to be very stealthy and have a stealthy approach to certain missions which I really love because I've always enjoyed stealth in video games such as Phantom Pain and a couple of other stealth games I can't really think of at the moment but yeah I've really enjoyed the aspect of stealth within video games and I'm glad that Battlefield have brought that to Battlefield 1. I would recommend this game to pretty much every gamer out there. This, I would well and truly say that this game has a very big potential to be a game of the year for 2016. It is a phenomenal game with a very, very solid storyline. I mean, set in World War 1, what more can you ask for? The graphics are absolutely unbelievably real and just the whole aspect of being in World War One and feeling the struggles that these soldiers went through so many years ago is just mind-blowing and really really deep and amazing to experience and to know the pain and suffering that they went through fighting for their country. I give Battlefield 1 a solid 9 out of 10. Alright guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like. And if I'm new to you, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!